Hey, Math 31, I had a request to do number 37 from section 3.4. So we're looking at how we can decompose this function, h of x, into two functions, f and g, such that their composition gets us back to h of x. So I want to figure out how can I define f and g so that f of g of x is equal to h of x. And there's many solutions. I'm going to show you one here. Because I think of this as I look at these as this is the inner function, just the x minus 1, and then the cube root is the outer function. So that's why you see map, me mapping the inner function to g of x and the outer function to f of x. But let me show you that this is working, and then I'll give you an alternative one that's a little less intuitive in my opinion. So if we went and took f of g of x, all right, that would be f of, all right, so our g of x is equal to x minus 1. Right, so the rule says, hey, instead of g of x, let me go ahead and write our x minus 1 here. And then for the rule for f says, hey, what's ever in those parentheses, go ahead and put them in your cube root. So this would then become the cube root of x minus 1, which sure enough is equal to h of x. So that's one possibility. Let me give you another set. Again, it's less intuitive. I'm going to scribble it over here. I could have let f of x be equal to the cube root of x plus 2 and I could have chosen g of x to be x minus 3. All right, now this will still work. I, I, I don't think it's intuitive, but it, it works. So let's go ahead and take a look at f. Oops, excuse me. Let's look at f of g of x. So like always, right, instead of g of x, I'm going to write my function. All right, so this will become f of x minus 3. And this rule now says, hey, whatever's in the parentheses here, which happens to be x minus 3, Let's put it under a cube root and add 2 to it. So this is going to become the cube root of x minus 3 plus 2. All right, well, these are like terms. So when we look at x minus 3 plus 2, I'm looking now at the cube root of x minus 1. And sure enough, that is h of x. So there's another combo. So this is a completely legitimate answer. This is another completely leg legitimate answer. And then there's tons of answers out there. That's again why I say there are many possible solutions, and here are two of them. All right, thanks so much, guys. Bye.